Hello YouTube, Wes here checking in and welcome back to a brand new episode of Movie Time with Wes. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. I've got a lot of different things going on here on the channel. This channel is all about the stuff that I'm interested in and hopefully uh, you'll be interested in similar things. Thank you for checking out the video. What we got here as, as seen in the title, we got a new Hamilton book order here. This is a Hamilton book clearance section order. Um, everything was from the $4.99 and below section as far as DVDs and Blu-rays. Uh, picked up nine titles this time, so let's get this cracked open and see what I picked up. Okay, we'll start off on this 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 half of the. Uh, the burrito here, I guess, the Hamilton book burrito. First thing I got here is a TV series, uh, Michael Moore's The Awful Truth. Uh, season uh, one and two, I think there were only two seasons. Um, but yeah, series I have I have seen before, I enjoyed. It's been a while since I've seen him and I've kind of been following along. I uh, just recently, recently subscribed to Michael Moore's podcast and I've been getting back into watching some of his documentaries and stuff. So I thought this would be a fun pickup and it was not not expensive at all. So as I said, $4.99 or below. Don't remember exact prices. Let me see if I can pick that out on this one. Um, that was $3.95 for that series. Uh, excellent deal. All right, the second one here, we got a Blu-ray disc of the movie Hard Bodies. Uh, yeah, kind of an 80s, 80s cheesy, uh, cheesy movie. Thought I'd go ahead and grab this. Uh, that one was $4.95. Uh, there is the the regular cover. It's cool that it came with this uh, sort of VHS VHS slip cover. That was really nice. Uh, so it was nice to pick that one up. Thought that one would be a fun watch. Not too expensive. All right, the next one we have here. Uh, Naomi Watts and Robin Wright in the movie Adore. Um, this one was $4.95. Uh, I don't remember what the story was behind this. Um, Escape to a close-knit seaside community where friendship, love, and lust collide. Starring Academy Award winner nominee Naomi Watts and Golden Globe nominated actress Robin Wright. Adore is a sensual yet thought-provoking drama in which two lifelong friends find themselves entangled in passionate sexual relationships with each other's sons as they struggle to make sense of conflicting emotions and desires. The lines between family and friendship and morality are blurred. When powerful bonds, bonds reach their breaking point, discover what truly keeps us connected. Uh, sounded like an interesting interesting story to me, so I wanted to give that one a shot. All right, next one we have here is Charlize Theron in the movie a Young Adult, and this one was $4.95 as well. Uh, I don't remember hearing about this one, just had an interesting synopsis here. Uh, teen lit writer and one-time prom queen Mavis Gary returns to home to... Determined to recapture her fading glory by winning back her married high school sweetheart, but her unlikely plan sends Mavis's life spiraling, spiraling further out of control until she forms an unlikely bond with another old classmate who forces her to face adulthood's harsh realities. Uh, yeah, just nice drama there, so I thought I'd give that one a try. I like Charlize Theron pretty well. Alright, next one here is the movie Mercy's Girl. Uh, this one was $4.95 as well. Uh, not rated a Gravis Haas Adventures movie. Uh, Mercy, lives in a, Mercy lives a double life. In one, she is dating a, a sexual and loving college student named Jesse. In the other, she is living in her, by her family's religious standards. As her two worlds begin to collide, she must find her identity in both. Struggling alcoholic Mercy's life begins to come together with the help of a new friend, Jesse. Coming from a background of strict, strict religious objectionism, Mercy's falters as she begins to fall in love with a woman. Mercy moves into Jesse's world full of acceptance and surprising new freedom. She is given new meaning as she struggles to find consistent work. She finds courage in coming out to her distant father, all the while... Uh, the inevitable meeting of her religious religious mother hangs in the shadow. So, queer themed movie, uh, sounded like an interesting story. So I went ahead and grabbed that one. 
All right, this next one is a documentary. The documentary is Standing Up. How far would you go for a laugh? So this is a documentary following, I believe, four different aspiring stand-up comedians. It sort of just follows them around through their trials and tribulations of working out their 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 bits and and uh, you know tr trying out stuff with audiences and getting to know the hang of the uh, getting the hang of the uh, stand-up comedy scene. So I thought that was interesting. I'm I'm always uh, I always like watching uh, stand-up comedians do their thing. I'm always impressed uh, by by how how well they they can tell a story and make it funny. And uh, I thought it would be interesting to see a documentary about how that that all works out and had people who are starting just starting out in the business. Uh, so that sounded like a good one for me. All right, this next one again, four dollars ninety five cents. The movie Parked. This is an Olive Films release. Uh, from 2010, victim of the current recession, Fred Daly lives a quiet, isolated life in his parked car. His situation improves after he forms an unlikely friendship with uh, Kathol, a dope-smoking free spirit with a positive attitude. Uh, so yeah, just kind of a nice, nice drama there. Story sound like a good story. All right, this next one, another DVD here. This is the movie The Babysitters. It says on the back, the Babysitter's Club, this ain't. While Shirley Leonard, uh starts babysitting for Gail and Michael Beltran, her life becomes wilder than she could ever imagine. Shirley and Michael begin a dangerous affair when he pays her a big tip to stay quiet. She takes her babysitting service to a whole other level. As more of Michael's married buddies learn of his arrangement, Shirley, Shirley's calendar is soon filled with student babysitter and more married fathers than she can than she and her friends can manage. Their lives begin to unravel into a world of sex, money, and greed, making getting into college the least of their problems. And the last one, another one at $4.95, Meryl Streep, Shirley MacLaine, Dennis Quaid in Postcards from the Edge. Heard a lot about this movie over the years. I've never actually seen it, so I'm looking forward to getting the chance to see this one sometime. There is the front cover on that one. Uh, yeah, so that's going to do it for my Hamilton book haul from the clearance section, $4.95 and below. Hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for future videos. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day, great night. See you at the movies. Cheers.